hi guys so welcome back to my channel i know it's been hectic um so i just want to tell you guys a little bit um about how's it going and how is it being at the college and all that good stuff i also received some inquiries for some reason i could not get into my account i recorded and i restarted my phone and attempted to trying to get into my account and i lost my video that i recorded for you guys so this is a little late, so I'm sorry. It was actually supposed to, um, I was supposed to have it at midpoint. I did it in my office to show you guys all the books and everything that they give us. But yeah, this is nursing school. So let's get right into it. Um, so where we left off was at registration. I have some questions. I had some questions from some of the viewers about registration. You do have to go through an interview process. We all had to go through it. But I feel like when you do the interview process, you're already in. So yes, there's an interview process. We all have to go through it. And if you have already started your process, and that's your next step. It's probably gonna be that it's really close and you're gonna receive your um, acceptance letter suit. I'm sorry, I'm a little hoarse. It is very early. So my last video that I couldn't post, I'm gonna go over some of the contents that I put there. So some of the things that I spoke about there was about um, timing. So when you consider this college, if you do not live in New Jersey, guys, plan, 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 plan. I was leaving my house at four o'clock in the morning because I lived two hours away and I had to be there by seven. And I was walking because I didn't have my car. I wasn't driving. Um, so it was difficult. It was very difficult and I had to make sure that I made it on time to, you know, my classes and stuff like that. Once we started clinicals, I started taking my car back because I was just like, I'm not doing it. Yes, Jersey College does have parking. They have parking, their parking, they do have a feed for their parking. It's not free parking, but right across the street, there's a Walmart. If you're going to the New Jersey, campus i know more about the new jersey campus because that's where i go i go to the jersey campus so therefore if you're going to the jersey campus you will find um some parking if you're going to the other campus i'm pretty sure they have um parking if you guys really really want to know i can find that for you guys post that in my next video um so once i pass the interview process once I did the interview, if I'm not mistaken, I went in for orientation. Guys, you need to pass your drugs and your drug exam. Excuse me. Oh, um, you need to pass your drug exam. If you do not pass your drug exam, you will get um they will tell you that you have to start again or you will not get accepted. So make sure I personally seen people who started and they and when they kept asking them for the drug exam they failed and they got stopped so if you smoke weed you do any type of drugs you need to stop now because it's very important that you pass it you cannot be under the influence by working with sick people you just can't do it so it's, it's, a, it's a good way to say i'm gonna get myself together i'm gonna stop so when i do go to school and i do get drug tested i'm good and the urine exam is um under supervision they provide a clinic that you can go to. I use their clinic. I was okay with it. It's urgent care. It doesn't really belong to Jersey College, but it's just one of the clinics that they recommend. Um, and it was observed. Someone was in the bathroom with me. Um, so that's one important detail to know. Um, once I started, uh, we received orientation. Uh, we received our uniforms. We received uniforms. We received our books. If you don't have a laptop, you can buy one off of them for like 500 bucks and you can pay as you go, so which is good because some people don't have the money. Some people don't even have $200 to buy a laptop and I understand. So that's really good of them um, to provide um, laptops for their students at financial aid cost, of course. Um, they're very flexible with payments. Like if you have to pay, you pay every month. Um, if you're falling a little behind, you let them know. So it's not that bad. Uh, I also read a comment um, about the graduating rate. So I have spoken to a couple of um, grads 
and they tell me that their exit exam it's not that bad as people were saying maybe it got updated over the years and it's gotten better but i've talked to recent grads um and that's why they have communicated with me i can't talk from experience because i'm not there but we are planning on doing a podcast and we will have some of their graduates come on hopefully um so yeah their uniform consists of a white shirt with their logo you get um two white shirts you get two pants and you get a lab coat i purchased a black shirt these white shirts get dirty really really fast so you have to be on top of washing your clothes um what else is important to tell you guys books oh my god you get so much study courses so much study guides it's really really good um you have to do um you have to do uh some courses online on their cannabis and they're pretty good you don't really get like homework assignments from the teacher but you do have to do um eqes and prep use um and those help you get credit for your exams exams are tough but they're not impossible to pass a lot of people have passed with very high grades and so are the quiz i feel like the teachers are very flexible so far <laughs> i'm still in term one um yeah so like i said to consider child care if you have children traveling time as well um what you're going to spend traveling and sometimes for food they do have a microwave so you can take your own food over there um the the campus is very very clean very clean i love that about them you do have clinicals and those start right away so like third week or fourth week that you're in for us it was the fourth week but usually it's the third week um we had clinicals we did clinicals at nursing homes we were supervised we're still doing now we're supervised and then we have lab so it's it's basically four classes that you're doing your first semester so two in class and then uh clinicals and lab so it's um sorry funds fundamentals of nursing and amp autonomy physiology but um rather than that i overall i think it's i like it that i picked it it's it's a good school remember it's an accelerated program so it's not going to be easy it's hard it's hard you have to study you have to put your work in you get we've been getting one quiz a week and um one exam a week so the studying yeah you have to study reading you have to read there's no way that you're gonna pass it if you're just like oh let me go here and i'll just fly through it Mm -mm. Mm -mm. you have to study guys have to have to have to have to study it's very it's very important i can't stress it enough because i was one of the sneaky ones and i was like okay i'll get up you know i think i can just get it without studying no and i'm very smart (laughs) um studying is important make sure you plan get a planner um yeah guys you know do the best you can and if you guys have any questions or want to know anything you can ask i'm back on the channel i was able to recover my my login information you can always ask you can always send me a message um my instagram is there too the reason i knew you guys were writing comments was because someone reached out to me on instagram so make sure you follow my instagram make sure you subscribe so you can see when i do post and thumbs up thank you guys bye bye